it's Pete here, and I'm back for the weekly free instant tournament. This is an 8-board BBO tournament uh, that you can play by going Solitaire Bridge and then weekly free. So let's uh, see how we can do. So 14, 21, and a 5-card suit. This is all aces and kings. And I'm a balanced hand, and I could open 2 no trumps 20 to 21, but I think this hand's too strong for that. Um, because of my five card suit, all aces and kings, some good pips there as well. So I'm going to upgrade into two clubs and rebid two no top. Or not. Uh, I think this has worked out very, very poorly for me. Because I'm now going to get a spade lead through. But my partner should have good spade stoppers there. Um, six to eleven high card points. Uh, okay. Wow, okay, so I've got five spades, so there are eight missing. West jumped to three spades, which looks like they've got... Uh, um, looks like they have queen nine seventh and out. Well, they might have other stuff as well. Um, anyway, I, I could take a free finesse by letting this run around to the jack, but then that sort of blocks my entries, so... Here it's definitely better to rise up with the king to make sure I can guarantee three spade tricks. Looks like working on diamonds is a good option here. So I'll be able to get three spades, a heart's four, two clubs is six, two diamonds is eight. If diamonds break three three, or the ten of diamonds comes down, or west has the queen of diamonds, that's all good. Dummy's got five, six, seven points opposite my twenty-one, so twelve points missing. Um, don't really know how they're divided, but I do know that spades are breaking. Um, not great. So, let's start with a low diamond. Alright, so low diamond to the jack and queen. Now switch to a high club, which looks like West has Queen Jack of Clubs. Still don't know what's going on with the hearts, but uh, I could go spade to the Jack, Ace of Spades, Finesse a Diamond, but if that loses to the 10 Doubleton or something like that, um, that is really, really poor. Okay. Um, so, I still haven't built any more tricks. Um, West appears to have seven spades, one diamond. They might have three clubs and two hearts, in which case I can go king of clubs, club. Um, I might be able to build heart tricks as well. Uh, East has queen, ten, fifth diamond, stiff spade. They switch to the seven of clubs. Uh... I'm missing the Queen Jack 9. I don't know if West is like 7411 or 7132. There are a couple of different options for them. I was really hoping to see an honour there. This hand is not going well. Okay. So, clubs could be 3-3, three, three. they could still be 4-2. Um, Alright, so now we know East West has... Uh, I, I'm fairly sure I'm going down at this stage. Uh, West has... Two clubs, one diamond, three hearts. So I was really hoping West was the person with the clubs or that the clubs were divided. I 
Um, so I'll just exit a heart and go down one. So didn't pick that one at all well. 42%, that's reasonably generous for going off in a cold game. Um, but definitely had lots of options there. So someone made plus one. Let's have a quick look at what they did. They opened 2 no. They got a spade lead. They won the king. Diamond up. Club. And they were here. And finessed a spade. And ducked a heart. Wondering if they could go off from this point. Because they don't have any more entries to that hand. So they are still cold. Ah, East pitched a club, it seemed. So if I put East under some more pressure, maybe they would have misguessed. Uh, maybe I should, like, because I know Diamond's a 7 1, maybe I should play like a spade to the Jack, Diamond to the 9. Um, so let's have a quick think about this. So, spade lead, and I think a diamond towards the jack's fine. Okay, and now a club, no win. If I play a spade to the jack, and then a diamond towards the nine, if that loses to the ten, I can't get back to my spade, but they'll have to keep attacking something. And now I'll be able to get three diamond tricks, Two spades, two clubs and a heart. I've still got more potential. That's probably the best line. Um, here I was hoping just diamonds weren't 5-1. Um, even when diamonds were 5-1, I had lots of options of trying to guess what was going on. Uh, what did, like, what what suit was breaking? Uh, so, if... Uh, I was also hoping that maybe West had seven spades and four clubs. So when I cashed club, club, exiting, I might be able to squeeze East in hearts and diamonds. That was sort of my uh, vague plan there, but uh, went down in the end. Um, it was kind of bad. I had, I had a fair bit of information on the hand, and I think I probably should have made it. But a tricky one to start off with. Moving on to board number two. So this one we've got eight, 11 points, six card club suit where vol against not, and I don't have the mages. Um, and this is a best hand tournament. Um, I could try passing this out. And that scored 53%. Uh, so let's have a quick look at this. Uh, other vols are definitely open. Vulnerable against not, it's like usually an opening hand anyway, but because I know the po there's a fair chance it'll get passed out and I don't have the mages. I thought that was a reasonable uh, guess to go for. So the opponents can make three spades. So some people opened a club and then rebid two clubs and they can't make three spades, but you have to defend. Only one person managed to beat it. Um, so we've got two diamonds. A spade is three, a heart is four, and a club is five. And you have to make sure that you can get your club trick before they can throw uh, their loser away on um, a heart or a diamond. Didn't look that difficult. Someone opened three clubs. Other people, they got to four spades, doubled down one. Um, how does our hand play? So... We are cold for three clubs, and we can beat them in three spades. So technically, opening's the right choice here, um, because it's our hand. But uh, I think it's pretty close. Board number three. So here we've got 14, 20 points, four triple three. Yeah, I'll still open two now. I was vaguely thinking of downgrading the hand. Four triple threes are like a really ugly hand shape. Um, but here we've got four hearts, three spades, two diamonds is nine. And we just need to make some extra tricks. And we could play on clubs. We could... Looks like playing on clubs is a pretty good idea. And the general, we've got all the good pips in clubs, so we can double finesse clubs and try and make 11 tricks. 
Um, okay, so that solves that issue. Uh, so this one looks like it'll be pretty flat. Uh, so they get their queen, and now we've got the uh, rest of the tricks. Maybe we get 53 for this, but uh, plus two. What? 71%? Um, okay. Look, like, I, I don't think people are appreciating the fact that uh, their clubs are this good. You could run your hearts, but that just sort of ruins some entries for picking up the club suit. It's a really good percentage just going for that. Um, so, very happy with my 71% there. I think that was a bit of a freebie. Moving on to board number four. Four triple three, 20 count. <laughs> um, all right, we'll try it two now again. I didn't downgrade the last one. This one's got a couple of pips. It's got a heart suit. Um, question is, do I want to play in four hearts? Yeah. I was thinking, contemplating denying it. I don't think it's right. So, If I had maybe a bad heart suit or something. Uh, yeah. So, we have three clubs. We have... Three hearts is six. We have a spade is seven. Um, we can work on spades via a double finesse. All right. If East has Jack, ten, eight, two of hearts. I could like win this crossover, lead the nine, and it would go nine, ten, king, five. And if I was playing west for jack five doubles, and I could actually pick that up. Random suit combination there. Um, yeah, so I'll we'll just play a club to the jack. And I expect to lose a spade, so I'm going to play a spade towards the ten rather than the jack of spades at this stage. <laughs> you had me do it. Play for 6-5 Dalton. Alright, so win that. And Jack of Spades. Well, that failed. Um, we'll just set up the spade. We've got a club discard there. Lots of clubs. <laughs> so the double finesse and spades doesn't work, but uh, um, all right. So West has king queen of spades. Um, okay, and. Uh, I'm just going down now, aren't I? <clears throat> uh, yeah. 35% for down one there. That seems harsh. Um, is it harsh? <laughs> I can't believe I called 6-5 Dalton. Um, so... I've got two diamond losers and two spade losers. I could play for three hearts, uh, three clubs, and three hearts, three... Like, I, they'll, they'll be able to set up the spades in time. So maybe I have to play on the diamonds. So people who made that, what did they do? Don't tell me they played for 6-5 doubleton hearts. Jack of spades to the queen. Spade back. So if you lead the jack of spades, they return a spade, but a spade to the ten, they don't. 
seems odd. Um, yeah, so no one's really playing for the Jack 5 Dalton Hart. Um, just wondering what Gibbs says. Is Yeah, look at that. Nine of hearts. That's what you have to call for straight away. Um, the only reason I'm suggesting it is, like, West could be, like, leading a heart there looks like six doubleton or stiff six. And that was one chance, but the double finesse and spade still seemed pretty good. Um, but we're running in rank seven at 50%. If I didn't have such good odds in spades, I might have been more open to trying it. Uh, pass two diamonds. We'll just overcall two spades. Get to four spades. I'm not too optimistic about this. Um, I do have 15 points, but my queen X of diamonds, not as bad as I thought it was going to be. Um, but some chance is going to go heart, heart, heart rough. And we still lose a diamond as well. Um, but uh, let's just uh, see. Okay, that's good news. I, I put the king up there because, like, not that East could ever have five hearts on this auction, but I really want to encourage them to play another diamond um, just to make sure I don't lose to the uh, heart rough. Okay, so we just draw trumps and just curious. Whew, could have beaten me. And 68%. Uh, for four spades making. Some people only got to three spades. Um, <laughs> like, the, these auctions look... Some people are raising to four spades. I don't really like that. I think I just lucked in to my robot bidding four spades. I don't think this hand's worth a four spade raise if your partner competes to three. Uh, your partner definitely has a four spade bid. Um, so, peculiar, but I'll take it. Uh, 68%. So I'm running in rank 6 at 54. Uh, board 6. So here we've got 10, 15 points balanced hand. So a bit of no trump. And my partner didn't make a takeout double. So my partner's got a short heart. Um, but not many points. So we've got two hearts and a club. I think they're really making this. I'm tempted to make a takeout double myself. Partner bids clubs. That's really, really bad. Um, but let, let's risk it. I don't want to sell out here. Whew. All right. Pushed him up a level. And found out what suit I should be leading. Hopefully. So my partner likes diamonds. So we got two hearts. And I want my partner in to lead a diamond a spade through. Um, because I'm fairly sure Declara will be able to set up the uh, spades in time. And I know that ace doesn't have that. So let's just go up with the ace. And also, they might have tried roughing a diamond, so my partner's got five diamonds. Uh, and I've got spades. My partner had a fantastic hand. Not really sure why they didn't uh, compete themselves. They had queen... Did they have a 6-4? 78%. Uh, no, 4-2-5-2. They were favourable. I would, like... They don't have a great hand for a double because they've only got a doubleton club. Um, so it's understandable why they didn't want to do that. Uh, other people let them make nine tricks. Some people got to four spades by making a takeout double. I really much prefer uh, one no trump over call on this hand. You still aren't ruling it out. Surely they can beat four spades. Yeah. Um, 
and we can beat uh, three hearts ourselves. Um, I didn't like because my partner had the queen of spades. I didn't need to uh, lead a low diamond to them. But this hand had really cool inferences here. So I led a low diamond, and they flew with the ace. And the first thing is my partner played high in courage, but also ace didn't try running it round to the queen. Next thing that you get to know is when it goes heart to the ace and the heart back, they're not trying to rough any diamond losers, and they don't have clubs set up or spades set up to just discard them. So ace only has two diamonds. So at this stage I know I can draw trumps and put my partner in. So I let a low diamond rather than king of diamonds, because we were still beating this even if my partner didn't have the queen of spades. So 78%, um, and we are running in rank 5 at 58.35%. Board 7, 14 bagger, 3, 2, 4, 4. Uh, I'll just open a diamond. Rebid 1, no trump. Invite. Okay, well, a maximum. I thought about briefly uh, opening three no trumps. So we've got four club tricks, three spades is seven, a diamond is eight. And need to find a knife. Um, so, couple... Well, it looks like hearts is probably the best bet. Um... I could, like, win in my hand and lead the eight of hearts. Um, I can hope that West has ace king of hearts or jack ten of hearts. If I lead the eight and it goes eight, ten, queen. So I can't really hope for jack ten, actually. So hoping West has ace king of hearts is one option. Alternatively, I could just win and lead a small heart to my 8. Um, that might set something up. It's tough for them to pick that. Uh, diamonds? What do we got in diamonds? We're missing King, Queen, Jack, 9. So if I win and lead the 10 of diamonds running, that's not great. It's going to come from hearts, but I really don't think West has Ace, King, so I don't want to pull a heart towards the Queen. Um, so... So we'll just play another heart. So we could have uh, Ace King third heart. So I could run this round and come out a small heart, see if that uh, wins. Got it! Um, so that was a pretty lucky make there. Um, East had Ace King third. So they're going to get one more trick. 100% for that. Um, no, they had Ace King fourth. Oh, did they fly? So small club, heart towards my 8 and 10. Another club. Heart up to the 9. So this is one other small point, is they don't know what's in my hand. If I was leading towards the Jack of Hearts, maybe they had to fly and get their tricks early. It was still a poor choice. Um, but uh, I, I gave them a problem by leading towards the hidden hand, and they mis mispicked it. Um, so... Cool. <laughs> Pretty lucky there. Even luckier make than what I thought it was. Um, so I guess the other option was like winning in my hand and running the eight of hearts, but I feel like they would have covered that. So let's just see if someone else does that. Four of hearts. Oh, wow. A low heart, and they split with the ten. So they're now in the market to make this if they don't switch to diamonds. Oh no, because um, 
yeah, and still not quite good enough. I realized that Jack 10 on side wasn't good enough, but uh, yeah. So I got 100% for that, so running in 64% in rank 1. A um, bit of luck came my way. Um, misplayed a couple of hands so far, so not trying to deserve the luck, but uh, yeah. Club, two diamonds, pass, pass. So I could either make it take out double or maybe bid two no trump, 18, 19. Um, we'll go with that. What about cashing clubs immediately? So, so if you run all your clubs, um, the opponents know that we've got five of our points in clubs, haven't been playing on diamonds. I feel like I'll give them time to signal. Uh, it's an okay choice, but it also cuts my entries to the north hand. Um, so that's why I wasn't particularly interested in that, but yeah. It's another reasonable play. Whenever you're really, really stuck running along, so it's a decent sh option. Uh, so here we're in two no trumps when pretty much any other contract would be better, except for the fact we've now got three hearts, four spades, and a club. Um, let's see what's happening in hearts. Okay, that's fantastic news. We're up to nine tricks, so what I said about any other contract being better, three no was even better. Um, if I'd made a takeout double, then my partner would bid two hearts or two spades, and that loses two diamonds, two clubs, heart, has some issues. All right, so... Next option is, well, we're cashing our spades and our heart. So West has three, two, three spades, six diamonds. They've got a stiff club. All right. Did West pitch their club there? Um, no, they. I think they pitched Diamond Diamond. Uh, do I have any hope knowing that West has a... If West has... Yeah... I got the Queen of Hearts. I, I really should have paid attention to see if West uh, pitched their club or not. I don't think they did. So I feel like West has a singleton club on her. Um, in which case, maybe I could lead a diamond? I feel like I'm going to get my club in the end. I, I think I've pitched two diamonds, so I've got four diamonds in a club. Ninety-two percent for two no plus one. Um, pulling a diamond didn't actually help me on this layout. I was thinking maybe if. Uh, West had like singleton queen of clubs or singleton king of clubs and East didn't fly with the diamond so if they just played a low diamond maybe I could get them tangled up um, or if East flew with the king of diamonds and then played a club for whatever reason then maybe I could duck the club to West's hand and then they would have to play diamond diamond for me and I would score my diamond in a club so that were my just dreams of at the end, but uh, finished in rank one with 67.8%. Some people got to four spades or two hearts, not going so successfully. Um, it's an interesting one about what you actually do. There's also some merit for just passing out two diamonds sometimes, um, because partner hasn't made a bid when they've prob presumably got short diamonds. Um, so it really depends on which contract you think you're making. Um, and against 
two diamonds, we get a club, two spades, two hearts. So they probably make it um, on the friendly breaks and stuff. Uh, but yeah, that was the weekly free instant tournament. It was some pretty cool hands. Still not sure how to play hand number one. Board two was a bit dubious on passing it or not, um, but decided best hand tournament and I didn't have the majors or aces, so I passed. Board number three, uh, Tuno, and I just played on clubs for a friendly 71%. Board number four, I was tempted to pin that 6-5 Dalton Hart, uh, but I decided I had a better play available, but uh, went down <laughs> instead. Then board five, four spades making when they didn't get their rough, which I'm not sure why they didn't do it, because they played high-low, encouraging hearts. Then 78% uh, for beating three hearts, where I balanced because I was favorable. Double-check that I made a uh, takeout double before I did it, and luckily partner didn't bid clubs, but if they did... I would have had to pass it. I'm surprised my partner didn't try two spades on this hand. And had to be careful, had to lead a low heart. Well, I didn't need to lead a low diamond, but uh, it was safer leading a low diamond to my partner who can push a uh, spade through. Then 3 no making all the tricks when East flew with the hearts. Got a gift, but uh, I'm not complaining. And then finally, uh, 2 no plus 1 on a heart lead, hearts broke. And yeah, so that was the weekly free instant tournament. Got my fair share of luck, but uh, hope you enjoyed it. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you next time. Bye for now.